Hey everybody, it's Enderbon. Welcome back to more Legend of Zelda Wind Waker HD. This episode, we will be going to this aisle here, the Ice Ring Isle, and seeing what lies there. So we will shoot that and completely miss. I said, shoot that. There we go. Okay, so what we need to do is go in there. Grab it, and then get out. So I deleted some videos from my file, and last time, uh, last time, Fraps lag, that was a problem, and it seems to be working fine now. Actually, you know what? Give me a minute here. I'm going to try to do two things at the same time here, because I know this game so well. Perfect! Okay, that was actually pretty cool. Um, <laughs> I was <laughs> able to get rid of the flat Fraps numbers, because it's less things in the screen for it to focus on, and... Uh, commentate and play at the same time. So I was impressed with that. What can I say? I know this game well. And that was Will's belly. Never again. I'm, I'm disturbed. Will is just pressing his belly on me. And if, uh... Love you dearly, Will. It's a big belly, though. Oh, jeez. I freaking, like, talked myself up. At least there's no lag. That's that's better. Uh, I think I called myself uh, Anderbun in this video. If I didn't, my name's Anderbun. I, I called myself Super Seal number one by accident. Name, uh, YouTube name change. Trying to get used to it. Understand. Super Seal number one just wasn't a very good name for me. I, oh, no, it's not. It was just a dumb name, I guess, in my opinion. Okay, so over here, we need to roll jump. Yeah. Make sure we're angled correctly in. Roll jump. Yes. Grabbed onto the ledge. Oh, I grabbed onto the ledge. Okay. Try a Conroy references to. Aside, I reference YouTubers way too often. Again, if you're new to this channel, it's another quirk of mine. We made it inside. That's like the main beef of this whole thing. The main, uh, the, the hardest part. Now, we're inside here. And we want to make sure that we do not fall into the... Got it. Watch out for these guys, because if they hit you, he's... I've always been annoying at every single game. Holy cow. In Breath of the Wild, they they come in packs, and they're the most annoying things. I try to climb something, and they'll just... Like, they'll just tap you, and you'll just fly off. It's like the most... Speaking of Breath of the Wild, I've been playing that a lot. I, oh, whoa. You just... <laughs> that was very amusing for me. Let me just do it. 180 spin. But anyway. Anyway. Let's go out here. I forgot to show where this is on my map. Hold on. This is where it is on the map, so... Uh, go here, because I, I did not go here in any part, I just kind of... I'm sorry about that, I completely forgot to do that. We got the thing! We got the iron boots! Uh, that will help us with something very important. But, um, bottom, bottom. Sound like a freaking minion. Those on, and Link will be able to survive uh, harsh winds. Go down here. Hit that. Let's fight these guys one at a time here. First off, let me take this out so I can take this. Perfect. Get out of here. Got it. I'm done.
stronger than oh I was literally wondering if this was stronger than my current weapon thinking like is this stronger than my current weapon will I be able to carry it when in actuality this is not breath of the wild I've been playing so much of that I promise I play more than Zelda and I do plan to play other games on this channel it's just Dude, oh, sorry. Again! Breath of the Wild! Okay, wait a second. I'm... Gotcha! over here. Got a couple of these guys. Shouldn't be a problem. Alright. Uh, enter this pot here. Uh, so yeah, I mean, how you guys been doing? I'm playing the, a lot of Zelda Breath of the Wild and then a lot of this Zelda well, because I mean, I love Zelda, it, even though it's not all I play, it's not my favorite franchise of all time, I'll, I'll see to that, I beat, I beat the main story of it, I gotta say, it's a great game, it's definitely up there, I don't know where, though. like, it's hard, to... oh, God. randomly, like, glitched out there, but whatever, we'll just keep going from that, oh, man, the game's running so nice now, I'm so happy, so it was just a matter of, uh, what am I trying to say? It was just a matter of having too many videos on there and not working well because of that. And the sound is working too now, so this is all just... Everything's going my way! Everything's going my way this episode. I don't need to say anything though, honestly. Ah, oh, this game looks so beautiful! Ah, oh, I love the lighting of this game. I love the lighting so much. I gotta, I gotta give credit to the GameCube version. When it came out, it was great, and I still think if this game never came out, if the HD version never came out, I would still play it frequently. But it's just the lesser of the two versions, so I play this one more often. You know, I can get to place to place faster. I just... I'm not... You know, I have a decent amount of free time, but I mean... I don't... I prefer not to waste it sailing around in a game. I prefer playing games where I'm actually doing something, you know? And I don't mean to insult one Waker. I love the game to death. Uh, even the GameCube version. I played the GameCube version before I played this version anyway. Just, uh, I beat it right before. I beat it right before uh, One Waker HD was even announced. So, and I, I loved the game. It was great. Everyone was like, "Oh, this game sucks." So yeah, that's everything here. That's all the treasure chest here. I uh, just wanted to show all that stuff off. And where is my boat? Yellow yeah, rupee over there. Grab that. Let me check something here. Okay, yeah, we do have enough. All right, I'm gonna take care of something before we move on with the main story. A little, little side quest things. Ooh, piece of heart. Okay, well we can take care of that too then. Yep. So let's go to the place where we started out our adventure. Use this. I always like the fast travel that like shows that the character is teleporting and not just skip to this area. Because that means the character is like, in Xenoblade Chronicles, you want to do all the side quests? Think about how much the characters have to do. Like not you yourself because you're just skipping there and it's whatever. It's just a funny thought to me. I don't know if anyone's played Xenoblade Chronicles. I, I want to let's play that game, but it's so big. But 
It's so great. Ooh, mail. Two letters. So. The other one. Okay, so this is just a. Uh... Errol telling you about his journey. Think about it for a second and uh. We've already done what we set out to do. We went out to save our sister. We went out to. Uh. Yeah, that's about it. We just went out to save our sister. We weren't planning to do anything else. We weren't planning to get into this uh, whole saving the world thing. It's interesting. Try to hit him a hundred times or more. So you have three spells, and if he hits you uh, three times, then it's over. So you need to time this. Please. Oh no, I pressed A. Ah, I pressed it. Crap, let me make sure I get this last hit, last hit on him. There we go, okay, don't kill me. Enough! Peace of heart, baby! Ah, oh, that took a long time. I did that on my first try, it was just 500 hits, man. That's a lot of work. Over here, though, you want to examine that. Ten across Hyrule. Find ten, so we have ten. So we're gonna go to our items. To select them. Alright, this is important. This is a really cool move to learn. Hold B. And let it go! You learned the hurricane spin! This is... Oh, man, this is a good move to have. Oh, man, we made him cry, dude. Okay, so... There's a few things I want to do. Now that we're out there. Now that we have... Uh, the wrist that allows us to carry giant things. Go over here and watch this. We can now carry this gigantic pig, and I have one destination in mind for him. If you attack him, and get him to attack you, he does tons of damage. He does more than Ganondorf at the end of the game does. Sorry, spoilers, but we all knew that was coming. Uh, yeah. More than Ganondorf. That is a powerful pig. If, if you count enemies as just anything to attack you, this is the most powerful enemy in the game as you cannot kill it and it can do three hearts of damage to you. So 
Be nice to it. It is your friend. That's all I have to say about that. So, going over here, we're just, you know... This is a slow episode. I know, but, I mean, it's... Uh, there's nothing I can do about it. It's gonna be slow. I also am trying to send a test recording. So, you know, by doing stuff that... So he will go over there, and he will... Watch this. Yes, he will dig under there, and... Peace of heart, baby. Give me. Okay, so. Uh, next time on Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker. We will be probably getting our last piece of heart before we head off to the next area. And then we'll be heading off to the next area, like I just said. See you guys then.